hello everybody and thank you so much for watching this video and thank you so much for supporting me i love you guys <laughs> but today in this video i'll show you how you can mirror your desktop yeah you heard that right a desktop screen onto a small tv now we've been doing this on uh, cell phones on laptops but this time we'll be using our desktop to mirror desktop screen onto any small tv and that's pretty easy trust me you don't have to do anything just follow my steps all right now before we get into this, I never tried this before and trust me, we'll be doing this all along and if we get failed or it won't work, I'll, I'll be, make sure to you know um, give live feedbacks on my Twitter or maybe on YouTube and uh, tell you guys that it's not working, don't follow the video and nothing like that, so yeah, don't worry. Now in this video, you're going to be needing a few things here, like um, actually a few things, things you need is a wireless network uh, or the wireless card for network. Now, if you don't have no idea what I'm talking about, is exactly what I'm. T uh, it's about it's about connectivity for wireless connectivity. I'm talking about you. Do you have a wireless connectivity on your desktop? Now, for example, um, for example, for my uh, for my desktop, it's a high-end gaming desktop, so I don't have to worry about wireless connectivity. I can easily show you by clicking on that. Okay, right-click on that screen. That's the internet icon. Go to open network change it out of settings go to there and then you can see that I have the that's the that's the network that's the physical cable that I need to install in my computer and that's the Wi-Fi that I can not use and for example if I double click on that one wait a second okay I need to disable that one first okay now let's see okay see it's working now if you can see on my screen you can see that the icon of Wi-Fi is appearing now that's by default you can also buy a, a um, separate wireless card for this or also you can uh, you go to the computer shop and buy this card it completely it's pretty cheap you can get it for five bucks or maybe ten bucks the max you can it's not more and trust me it's really cheap okay now wh what you want to do is to connect your desktop I don't know how to connect that one. I never tried the Wi-Fi before. Okay, you can do that. Now, uh, click on that. Click on your network. Enter your password. Um. Okay. That's it. Okay. Now it's connecting. Just that's the part we need to be there. Okay. Uh, sorry about that. God. So big, isn't it? Now that's a, that's that's the basic part. Now it's the Wi-Fi is connected, and now we need to go back to the TV. All right, on TV, uh, you need to go to the settings, go to network settings, and then you need to turn on your built-in wireless LAN, and try to uh, enable the wire direct Wi-Fi to my help you sometimes, you know. All right now, now, after doing that, you need to go to the connected devices and find the screen mirroring, and tap on it. And yeah, you need to wait here because it says enabled. Now we need to go back to computer. All right, all right, come back to the computer after pro uh, completing the process in the TV. Now it's fairly simple here. Just go to the uh, setting. Yeah. Oh, okay, fine. Finally, fine. Okay, now go to the settings. I know I don't know how exactly how you can go in that that settings, but you can also go to the personalization and go to that settings. That's fairly easy. All right, now in in settings, go to the devices. Uh, and before you do this, just make sure you don't have any kind of connected devices like Bluetooth. Um, maybe um, maybe NFC connected devices, loudspeakers, uh, phone connected devices, and come like that. So just make sure you don't have anything connected to that either. Okay, now once go to the connected devices, click on that edit voice. Am I? That's it. That's 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 what I'm talking about. And it, it all depends on your uh, your. It all depends on your router and how far it is. Like for example, my computer is on an, uh, in another another room, and my TV is in another room. So it all depends on your router, like how far the strength of your signal is. 
like for example i can use my wi-fi outside of my home but that's that's what you want to make sure that how far you can go with your wi-fi so finally i got this screen that's that's the tv i need i can click on it okay now it will sh that's that's the thing that you need to and i'm pretty sure that's connected let's get back to the tv and see if that's working all right let's back to the tv let's get back to the tv it might take some time to mirror your desktop on the smart tv and depending it all depends on your network speed and the range and the length and the wireless and the wireless connection and also the wi-fi strength thank you so much for watching guys and by the way i, I told you guys that i will tell you that if it's working or not but trust me it is working i tried it before but i couldn't even make a video because it took some time to you know i load the desktop on the smart tv it took about 12 18 minutes or so it's, it was a long time i wasted a long time and i was trying to cancel it but it was not so yeah thank you so much guys hope you like it Bye bye